Our recommendation to the G20 is to tilt innovation towards a fourth industrial revolution that solves the problems of the many. Technology is not the answer, it's the amplifier of intent. And we're entering into the age of the algorithm where there is the potential to increase income inequality, to create a destabilized society that's jobless. There's equally the potential to direct those technologies to solve the challenges that we've got in healthcare, in education, in water, in sanitation, in climate. That is what we think is the opportunity that will create a stable and inclusive growth that will last. We're talking about technologies like artificial intelligence, the internet of things, robotics, quantum computing even, and in the biological space, biotechnology, and the physical space, advanced materials. These are technologies that are fundamentally already transforming industries across the world in every single sector. Industries that will look completely different in 10 years time than they do today. This is top of mind of CEOs and it needs to be top of mind of governments. We need industry and governments working together to create the right enabling environment both to safeguard this technological revolution, to make sure we don't get the unintended consequences on jobs, on data privacy, on cybersecurity, etc., but also to maximise innovation, to maximise investment and public-private partnerships so we can use these fourth industrial revolution advances to solve some, some of society's most challenging social and environmental problems.